We're bombarded with media, messages, propaganda, and advertising all day long. And we need to sift through all the BS to figure out what's fact, while at the same time, consider all the information from a place of clarity and objectiveness. It's probably harder to do that now than at any other time in history, which is the exact reason we've compiled this list for you. Here are 10 books that will help you think more clearly. Number 1. A Field Guide to Lies, Critical Thinking in the Information Age by Daniel J. Levitin. This author is a New York Times bestseller and his third book doesn't disappoint. This one opens your eyes and mind to dealing with information overload, something we all face these days. While some information is clearly BS, a lot of the info we're exposed to can be tricky to figure out fact from fiction. In this book, the author explains how to use science as the bedrock for critical thinking. Being info-literate is integral in the 21st century, and Levitin affirms the importance of using words and numbers we encounter to be successful is just as important. Once we've got the information in front of us, it's vital to not blindly accept it and move on, but instead double or triple check its plausibility, its origin and reasoning, and only then make an educated decision or viewpoint on a subject. The book has thousands of five-star ratings. One reviewer said, this is a book about how to spot problems with the facts you encounter, problems that may lead you to draw the wrong conclusions, critical skills that we need today since we're blasted with information in a society based on conspicuous consumption. Number 2. Critical Thinking Skills for Dummies by Martin Cohen Hey Luxers, if our first suggestion seemed a little bit daunting, then we suggest you start off with this one by Martin Cohen. We've all been in this situation before. You have an argument or heated discussion with someone, but you become so flustered, and only after you walk away you think of the perfect comeback or argument. But it's too late, right? So this book will help you to manage your thinking in a coherent way that will come across as well thought out, educated, and reasonable. Just as a side note, it doesn't mean you're going to win every argument. It just means you'll develop reflective thinking skills that will help you to understand someone else's point of view, or even admit if you were wrong. Not bad for a book that's meant for dummies, huh? Number 3. The Art of Thinking Clearly by Rolf Dobelli this book began as a weekly column in newspapers in Germany, Switzerland, and the Netherlands. It was first published in German and topped Germany's Der Spiegel bestseller list, and since its translation, has topped bestseller lists in the UK, Ireland, India, Singapore, South Korea, and Iran. Once you've read it, you'll be recommending it to everyone because you'll notice a dramatic improvement in your thinking skills. The Guardian reported that Rolf Dobelli isn't thinking clearly, but when you listen to his arguments, you might disagree with their statement. Dobelli puts things into unique perspective. He highlights how we fear terrorism, but we should fear driving. Why? Because more people die on roads than by terrorist attack. Or how we believe that 98% fat-free is a healthier choice than 1% fat. As reviewer Joshua Elsie comments, this book helps you more conscious of your biases and more perceptive in observing biases that creep into group decision making. Number 4. Thinking Fast and Slow by Daniel Kahneman this one comes highly recommended by thousands of readers, and it's easy to understand why. Daniel Kahneman has hit the nail on the head with thinking fast and slow. Kahneman is an expert in the field of judgment and decision-making and behavioral economics, which saw him winning the 2002 Nobel Memorial Prize in Economic Sciences. The book speaks about the two ways in which we make decisions. System 1, fast, emotional, and intuitive, and System 2, slower, logical, and deliberate. He brings forward theories on how to marry the two systems to make for better and more fulfilling decision-making. Kahneman aptly quoted, Our comforting conviction that the world makes sense rests on a secure foundation, our almost unlimited ability to ignore ignorance. Number 5. The Demon Haunted World by Anne Druyan and Carl Sagan in this book, the authors delve into the well-known fallacies of witchcraft, UFOs, demons, and faith healing, and bring a comedic theory across, dubbed the Baloney Detection Kit, which, based on the name, you can probably figure out what they mean. 
Sagan was an astronomer, planetary scientist, and astrophysicist, just to name a few of his titles. Throughout his life, he offered up some amazing literary works, including Shadows of Forgotten Ancestors, Billions and Billions, and this one, The Demon Haunted World, and that's just scratching the surface. If you head to Audible, you'll have access to all of his writings, and if you're keen to hear one, remember to use our free download by going to alux.com slash free book. It's got plenty of five-star ratings, like this one. Always insightful, it seems that Sagan just wants to watch the world learn. I should have read this book at 15. Honestly, it probably should be required high school reading for everyone. And Aluxers, it's not like you have to agree with the theories you read about in any book. It's merely an invitation to examine what you do or don't believe and think about why, which as we highlighted in our video 10 Rules for Reading is very important. Number 6. Calling Bullshit – The Art of Skepticism in a Data-Driven World by Carl Bergstrom and Jevin D. West for the most part, we truly believe that we can successfully identify BS when we're given it, but do we get it right all the time? Hardly. This book is here to help you call out bullshit when you see it, and Aluxers, it's a noble act according to publishers Penguin Random House. Why this book is particularly worthwhile is it dives into the bull from our past and explains why it's still so prevalent today. The objective of both authors is to have a properly functioning society, and the only way we're going to get there is to separate fact from fiction. Number 7. The Design of Everyday Things by Don Norman Right off the bat, let's share one of the hundreds of thousands of five-star reviews. After reading this, you will never look at any man-made object the same. You will question everything from doors to tea kettles to the most sophisticated computer program. The next time you fumble with an answering machine, a web page, or a light switch, you'll think back to the lessons from this book. It's almost liberating when you can see beyond the design of everyday things. And Aluxers, that's enough to have you ordering your copy pronto. Anything designed for humans goes through a process far more detailed than what you'd expect. This book will change the way you experience and interact with your surroundings. You'll acknowledge great design versus terrible design, and even your purchasing decisions will change according to what you learn. In Norman's words, anytime you see signs or labels added to a device, it's an indication of a bad design. A simple lock should not require instructions. Number 8. Fact versus Fiction Teaching Critical Thinking Skills in the Age of Fake News by Jennifer Lagarde and Darren Hudgens As clear in the choice of books today, ensuring that we decipher fake news quickly is paramount. Fake news polarizes people, creates fear, discontent, anger, and confusion, and people make rash, volatile decisions, and all for naught. This book is there to help you recognize and circumvent information that is not accurate. What makes this book special is that it uses real-life situations that are easy to identify with, as the book was published in 2018. It's relevant for both kids and adults. And speaking of kids, coming up we share why it's important to start educating them about thinking more clearly as soon as possible. But let's take a look at number 9 first. Factfulness – 10 Reasons We Are Wrong About the World and Why Things Are Better Than You Think by Anna Rosling Ronalund, Hans Rosling, and Ola Rosling. It's easy to feel overwhelmed and anxious about the current state of our planet. We often lose sight of the good because the bad seems to be taking over. One paragraph from the book sticks out. Here's the paradox. The image of a dangerous world has never been broadcast more effectively than it is now, while the world has never been less violent and more safe. This book provides clarity on global issues and why certain situations arise and how to not get wrapped up in the negative and fearful narrative that we've gotten so accustomed to doing. As the book reminds you, remember, things can be bad and getting better. Number 10. Paradox of Choice by Barry Schwartz He's an American psychologist and often published in the New York Times. He has eight books under his belt, but this one is by far the most recognizable. Picture this, you need to buy yourself a new laptop. You head to an electronics shop, you're faced with 15 different options across different brands, all promising you top speed, performance, and memory. Instead of just grabbing one of them and calling it a day, we're left anxious about which choice will serve us best. And as Schwartz says, all this choice hasn't helped us. In fact, it's doing us a disservice. But don't worry, he doesn't leave you hanging. He offers a great method to alleviate that anxiety and make better, more informed decisions faster.
All right, Alexer, we're curious. Have you read any books that got you thinking differently? If so, we'd love to hear your suggestions, so please share them with us in the comments. And of course, as a thank you for sticking with us until the end, here's your bonus. To become a clear and critical thinking adult, it's important to start as young as possible, which is why we recommend the book The Basics of Critical Thinking from the Critical Thinking Co. This book is suitable for children from the fourth grade and up, and uses beautiful illustrations, interesting storylines, and easy to understand explanations. The book will steer any child in the right direction of critical thinking, identifying and evaluating evidence to gain far deeper insight. It might be aimed at children, but trust us, even as an adult, you'll gain a lot from reading it too. Thanks for spending some time with us today, Alexa. We're so glad you joined us. We'd love for you to subscribe, like the video, and hit that bell icon to never miss any of our new releases.